All right, we had a big issue with the subframe paint. I think it was too cold outside. All the paint reacted and got. So now I have to wait a bunch of days for it to fully cure so we can sand it off and redo that. Super irritating, goddamn weather. But you know what, it's not gonna stop us because me and Dalton, we're machines. We're car mod machines. Yeah. Yeah, we're just gonna skip right over that. That's why this video is coming before the subframe when it's supposed to be the other way around. We're gonna try to paint the block of the K, start getting the K ready to go in. We need to paint the block and we need to paint the header. Right now we're gonna mask off the head and the oil pan because we don't wanna paint those, we just wanna paint the block. We're not gonna paint the valve cover yet, that's gonna be painted once the engine is in because we don't want the valve cover to get the shit beat out of it on the way in and then have to repaint it anyway. So yeah, me and Dalton got the heater, Chuchin, so we can heat this up so hopefully the paint doesn't react from the cold. We're gonna have to build another booth in here because now we have to paint inside because of the obvious issues. Too goddamn cold. Too goddamn cold. Up here living in our igloo. So uh, yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So uh, let's get into it. All Moist Boys clothing is currently 25% off. Link down in the description, pick something up. Look at this. Dalton's got the Styles Not a Crime hoodie, got the Crown Vic on Long Champs, and he's got the Moist Boys trucker hat. So uh, pick yourself up some, some goddamn sick ass merch while it's on a good ass deal. And yeah, let's get into it. Here's the K looking dusty as f Gonna mask off the front cover, mask off the oil pan. Probably just remove the engine mounts. Mask off the head so we're just painting the block. Homage to We're just about ready for paint here. Hopefully it doesn't go as badly as the uh, subframe. What are we yeah. saying about that? It's a little warmer in here, so. A little bit. We'll see. Some dupli color engine animal. And then once we've sprayed this, we're kind of... So me and Dalton's plan, so we don't have to worry about the engine bay getting oversprayed, is... Roll this hoe out the door, give it a chooch outside, roll it back in. Will it fall off the stand and fall over? Probably. Nice. So, uh, wish us luck with that. But once we do that, what are we going to do, dog? Oh, we're going to unwrap the headers and yeah. spray those. Exactly. So some devil header wrap the header. Don't do that. You look cool. No. Don't do that because it's... So it's not race car, it's stupid because it traps heat in and it's gonna crack your headers. Because it doesn't let the heat dissipate and uh, it's gonna crack your header. So we're gonna take that off. Probably give it a spray with some flame proof. So we're gonna use the Ignifuge Trace Hot Temperature, Silica Ceramic Coating, Silici, and Dwoot. Cookie crumbles. There you go. All right, well, we'll wait for this to heat up a bit more and then uh, check back in. Would you ever want a bigger sack? Like, like they were huge. Like a, like a grapefruit size. Yeah, you looked it up then. No, I didn't. You looked it up. No, but we had this conversation, no and you went really in depth. You're the one who watched the video. I read an article. No, I think it I was a it. documentary. It. It was a documentary. <laughs> I think you're up next. I think we should leave it there because I feel like if I keep going. Paint the. Uh... Okay. You think so? Yeah, I cleaned it really well. Really. Yeah, I give it a good scrub of the dub. Look how pretty it is. Oh fuck, you're getting it all over me. Oh, it's okay. Intake will cover all that. No, That's the thing is most of this shit will be covered. Like, header's gonna come all the way down here. 
intake on the other side. So it's not that important coverage. It's just we're here. Our subframes, f so we had nothing better to do. So yeah, should we move on to the header? Can I tell them about uh, the subframe mishap? Huh? Can I tell them about the subframe mishap? Don't even show them. It's too no, I'm gonna show them. The weather messed this uh, the subframe up, but as you can see, it's got this texture. Looks pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, super sick. But uh, it's not supposed to look like that, as you can see. Okay. So this is what happens when you. Uh, I don't know if that's a direct result, but I'm gonna say it is. Say you're driving in the rain, wouldn't this stuff get soaked and then just hold moisture against? Trap moisture in? It does make sense. All right, so that was an absolute nightmare. If you're ever about to header wrap something, DM me and I'll pay you $10 not to because that is actually the stupidest thing I've ever witnessed. Terrible time. And so now looking at this header all unwrapped, we see it, it is a DC some, but as you can see, it's been fucked with. I don't know if all these mod these crackhead modifications were to make it clear, like the A86 steering rack and stuff, but it's pretty haggard, so that's alright, we don't judge. I want to delete this, weld that up, delete this, this, and then there was a, look at that, look at that spatter, that's sick. But that was on there for the AFR gauge that used to be in the car, but that's gone now, so I'm gonna have to delete that. But it's getting dark. I sold my welder and bought a brand new one, and or I got a brand new one for Christmas and haven't set it up yet, so that's gonna take some time. Dialing the wire speed and stuff, so. Might be calling her quits on the uh, old header here for now. Oh, looking so suave. <laughs> Look at that. Barely looks terrible at all. Yeah, we just chew chew. We barely even fucking clean the thing. Yeah. We just gave her. So yeah, we'll probably leave that just like that for a day or something. You're not gonna put more coats on it? Well, I guess we could. I mean, there's like, there's like a little bit of, you know. All right, me and Dalton are gonna push this outside and do one more coat. I was gonna be lazy, but Dalton caught me in the act, so. Well, everyone, wasn't gonna end the video here. I wanted to, uh, finish the header and engine paint, but things don't always go as planned. Today we were meant to um, finish up the subframe, get it installed, but the weather had other plans and absolutely dicked our paint. So I was gonna wait to finish this, these tasks in this video before this video went up, but it's Sunday night. We gotta get on that Monday, Thursday schedule. You guys know that things don't always go as planned, so I'm gonna outro this video and finish off the subframe, engine, paint, and header in the next video. So, as always, well, not as always, but right now, the merch. Here you can see I got the trucker hat on, it's a bit dusty. But all the merch is 25% off, all the clothing, we got hoodies, t-shirts, toques, Trucker hats like this, 25% off. Link in the description if you want to support us. And um, I guess I'll show you how the block's looking right now. Pretty good. Not too bad at all. Looking forward to getting that all unmasked, painted up, and ready to go back into the car. So in the next video, you can expect either Dalton and I unmasking this and welding up the header and painting that, or we're gonna be doing the subframe. I gotta wait a couple days for that shitty paint on there to cure so I can sand it off and restart. Otherwise, it's just gonna gum up the sandpaper immediately. But yeah, we're moving forward with the 8.6, and um, just wanna let you guys know that I'm really trying to hit that Monday, Thursday upload schedule, but it's difficult doing it solo and with school and stuff, but I'm trying, so appreciate all you guys for hanging in there, holding out, Commenting, liking, subscribing really means a lot. And um, yeah, comment something below. The boys will try to hit a million cake up on that YouTube. The best content that nobody subscribes.
so 